YouTube, how the fuck you doing? Hey guys, Nate Shot. Today, I'm bringing a brand new video. This key that I'm holding in my hands right now holds so much mystery, and I cannot wait to find out if there's actually something inside the container that this key is meant for. Basically, the way that the mail works at the building that I live in is if you have a package that is too big for your little mailbox, the postman will actually take a key and then put your package in a bigger container so that you can later open up and get your package. The problem is, is that they put this key in your mailbox, but I don't really check my mail that often. Often. Really, the only things that I do are email and text messaging. Post mail for me is just so outdated and it's always so disappointing when you open it up because it's just bills, bills, bills. But I finally checked my mail after like two months and I found this key inside. The reason why I'm so excited to use this key is because I ordered a pair of sneakers about two months ago and I never received them, but it said it was delivered. And so I always assumed that they were lost in the mail. So I filed a claim on the website under the impression that the sneakers were never delivered. But this key actually might have those sneakers inside but it has been a long time, so I have no idea if they're in there. Let's go check it out. What do you think? If you gotta take a guess, you think there's gonna be any inside? I don't know. What do you think? Uh, I'm nervous. You smell nice. Thanks. Uh, what do you think? No way. It's been like two months, actually. Yes. I'm in shock. I really am. I'm so glad these were in the mailbox because this package right here fits the theme of this entire vlog. Windows down when we ride around through our town. Don't care what the weather is, volume to the max, we be living out loud. Got that dope flow that make you look in your library, never hit the books. I just wrote some words down and make catchy hooks. Well, look, it's stuck. All this attention they pay, and it's for me why they trying to get paid. All right, guys, so I just home. dropped Jenna off in Beverly Hills, and I'm actually still in Beverly Hills as well, but we're on two completely different paths today. I am on a mission. So last year on this YouTube channel, you guys know this, we unboxed a lot of sneakers. But in the last couple months, I really haven't been making any new pickups. Well, that all changes today. I can't help myself, guys. I am laser beam focused on today's mission and that is to pick up a pair of the Yeezy 350 Boost Zebras. I've been holding off on the Zebras for so long. When they originally dropped a couple months back, I think they only had a couple thousand pairs that they released to the public. So right off the rip, they were one of the highest reselling sneakers out of all the Yeezys. You could have been paying anywhere between like 12 to 1500 depending on the size. But just a couple weeks ago, they re-released the Zebras. I think they sent out 30,000 pairs worldwide. So the resale value dropped so significantly so now they're at a price where I'm comfortable paying for them and that's the goal right now I'm in Beverly Hills. I'm about to hit Fairfax. You guys have seen me come here before they got flight club out here undefeated There's so many different boutique sneaker shops out here and the goal is to get the zebras today now if you guys watch my vlogs you know this about me but normally i do not like coming to these brick and mortar sneaker stores and the sole reason for that is because they really don't give you the best price that you can get online now there are so many different ways now to find limited edition sneakers whether it's goat or stock x and you can always get the best price but i kind of want these now so that's why i'm coming out here to check out the shop Alright guys, well, today was an utter failure. Flight Club is closed, and I don't know why. I mean, it is considered a holiday Monday and Tuesday, I guess. What's up, man? Flight Club, though, let me down. I know Undefeated is this way, though. But if Flight Club's closed... Oh, wait, 535? Hold up. Do I just gotta go a little further down the street? Unfortunate reality about Flight Club, they don't allow filming inside the store, so... I asked them nicely, guys, could I just get a couple shots? I make YouTube videos. I just want to show the store off since I'm buying the sneakers. They really weren't having it. So it seems like a common thing with a lot of these stores out here in California. So I'm sorry that I couldn't get you guys a video in there, but I did sneak a couple pictures. Quick successful trip, guys. I know the prices of these shoes, so I paid a little bit over resale, but the convenience of getting them in my hand today, well worth it. I'm gonna pack them away, go see what Jenna's up to. We're gonna unbox these a little bit. Hi, Oreo. Hello. What are you gonna do right now? I'm actually gonna go do him uh, right now. No, no, you can't use that in the video. <laughs> <laughs> do you wanna go to In N Out or do you wanna go to Chick fil A? I wanna go to both. You're gonna have to pick one exclusively. Oh, exclusively? Singular. You which, can pick which one's either the or. most vegan? You can get a salad at Chick fil A. 
Oh, yeah, let's go to In N Out then. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that. All right, you guys go to In N Out? Hey, you want to just go get tacos? No. Yeah. Taco. What? No, 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 let's just go get tacos. We'll tell them we're going in and out. Okay. And we'll just go get tacos. We met up at Chick fil A and In N Out, two different fast food restaurants. Both Christian. I w Nailed it. <laughs> I wonder what it would be like if we combine these foods together. I guess we'll never know. Either way, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Hi. 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 Hello. Hi. Maddie, do you want Yeezys? No, he doesn't want that crap. Oh my god, watch your mouth. Maddie just got a bath and his haircut, so extra love from me today. Maddie, do you like Yeezys? Do you like zebras? Lick once if you like zebras. Oh, he, he licked. What if I got you Yeezys? What would you do? Should we talk about what just happened? Nothing happened. Guys, he asked me to go to dinner. No, I. And then he ate Chick fil A. No, I. This. I did not eat Chick fil A. I have video proof that I did not eat Chick fil A. I do. You ate Chick-fil-A. After a long, successful day, we're finally back at home base and it is time to unbox the mystery pair of sneakers that we found in our mailbox earlier. And then we're gonna get onto the zebras so I can finally open those up, give them fresh air, and put on the sneakers that I've been waiting so long for. First though, like I said, the mystery pair. I have not done an unboxing in quite some time, so I have no idea where any of my knives are. Nah, fam, we good. I got the Karambit, okay. Now, I actually double checked in the app to make sure I got the name right when I opened these sneakers. And I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know what I was thinking when I picked them up. I thought that they might be some underground heaters that would have a huge resale value. Ah, we'll, we'll just, we're just gonna open up. We'll see, we'll see what you guys think, okay? So, uh, I have, oh, that was the worst. That was terrible. Hold on. You would think after so long and so many unboxes, I'd be better at getting this box out, but God damn. Okay. It's the moment of truth. Are you guys ready to see what's inside? Ooh, I'm, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Oh. Ooh, what are you going to look like? Oh. All right, guys, these are the ADO Ultra Boost ZGs. That is the exact name for them. And the reason why I thought that these were gonna be a hot pickup, I think is just because of the earth tones that the sneaker has. The one thing I love about my tan Yeezys, the one thing that I wish I had are the cream Ultra Boost, the original, the 1.0s. I see a little bit of a similarity in like the earth tones on this shoe. And that's why I thought that they would be such a fire pickup because they can go with a lot of different outfits. I'm really happy with this sneaker. I was skeptical after looking back in the app after a couple months on what they were gonna look like, but I know exactly what I was thinking when I purchased these. And I don't care what any of you guys might have to say, I'm really happy with them. Let me give you a closer look. <laughs> Yes, dude. Ah, I've been waiting for this day for a little bit now, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm gonna enjoy it. I'm gonna take it all in, finally get excited because I have two pairs of the Zebra Yeezys in front of me. Let me take them out of the Flight Club bags, okay? Let me take them out, let me take them out. Now, I'm sure there's a few of you guys that are wondering, why do I have two pairs of the Zebras? I have not talked about this on my YouTube channel, and I wanna go over it more in depth, but basically, you guys are gonna get to know this person a lot better over the course of the next couple months, but some of you guys probably do know him. He's probably the biggest Call of Duty Twitch streamer there is on the entire website. His name is Nick Merckx. He's one of the most charismatic, trustworthy, and coolest people I've ever had the pleasure of meeting 
dating in my entire life. And he is actually moving out to Los Angeles, California. He's gonna be living one block away from me so that we can live close together and create some incredible content over the next couple years. So the reason why I bought two pairs is because this is going to be his housewarming present. I know that you normally get something for somebody when they're moving into a new apartment, like an appliance, a toaster, ah, a plunger, need, I don't know. I don't know normal housewarming gifts, but he likes Yeezys. He's got a pair of the breads and he's also got a pair of the creams. So I figured why not give him something that, that's more in line with me and 100 Thieves and just our friendship so I got him a pair of the Zebra Yeezys. Nick, I can't wait till you're living out here in California with me, man. It's gonna be incredible. The YouTube videos are gonna be lit. The streams are gonna be lit. I'm so excited. So when you get to California, it's the first thing I'm gonna give you is a pair of Zebra Yeezys. Looking forward to it, man. I love you, bro. Let's get it. Now, the moment we've all been waiting for, or I've been waiting for at least, hopefully that you guys have been looking forward to this since you started watching the vlog. Let's check out what's inside. Most of you guys do know what the Zebra Yeezys do look like but I'm gonna get that new experience all for us here right now. Woo, Flight Club, you made me overpay about 100 beans, 130 beans, but that's okay, we got them here today. Yeah. Finally, boys, finally, 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 Just take them both out. Yeah, smell exactly how I thought they would. Uh, <laughs> <ooh>. <laughs> Guys, the 350 Zebras. Come on, boy. 